Good morning. We are starting the day off strong. If my voice sounds crazy, it's because it takes me a hot minute to wake up, but we have conditioning this morning. It's a Thursday. So Tuesday, Thursday is conditioning. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday is weight. So today we have Thursday run, which is change of direction. It's like some suicide runs and like shorter distances down and back. But to me, this is the hardest day. So I'm hoping it's nothing too crazy. 7.30, 8.30 condition. And then we're going to walk right over to the softball field for practice at 9. So I'll check back in with you guys soon. But wish me luck. <laughs> Was it hard? Yes. But it wasn't actually change of direction today. We did like a med ball circuit for our conditioning instead. It was like almost hit training, really getting our heart rates up. A lot of core too. So we're working right now on doing everything very um, intentfully. Is that a word? Doing everything with intent and just moving our bodies the way that we want to that's gonna to translate to the field. So that's what we did a lot of today and I really enjoyed it. So we're starting the day off one for one. Hopefully practice goes just as good. All right, just finished practice and I am heading home. Practice was really good today. We did a lot of hitting. We have a game tomorrow. So on the practices before we have a game, we do a lot of hitting, almost like feel good, kind of get in rhythm with our swings. So that was really good. A little bit of throwing, not much defense today. So it was a pretty light day. Class starts in 30 minutes. So practice gets done at 12 and then drive home and I have class at 12.30. And that's just on Tuesdays and Thursdays. The other days I don't, which is nice, but today's a Thursday. So I have 1230 class, it's astronomy, and I need to go do a homework assignment that I might've forgotten to do. I'm so sweaty, but yeah. So class in 30 minutes, uh, then a little break. Then I have another class from four to seven. So I'll check in with you guys again in like 30 minutes for class. And hopefully by then I'll have that assignment done too. All right, see ya. I made it to class and time to learn all about astronomy. In my little 30 minute break between practice and class, I just showered, got ready for the day. My hair is still a little bit wet, threw on some comfortable clothes. I'm in a hoodie and light blue sweatpants, really comfortable. And I get in my little Zoom setup area. So I just sit on the couch with like my comfortable blanket, my computer out. Normally for classes that I don't have to participate as much in, I like to go to a coffee shop or on campus or something just to kind of get out of the house and do class somewhere else. But in this one, we go in breakout rooms a lot and so you have to participate and it's a little bit weird to be talking to a screen in public. So I just stay home for my astronomy class, but it'll be done in about an hour 30. So I will come back and check in to show you guys what I have going on next. But until then, I'm gonna be learning all about light emission and colored wavelengths. So I think we'll see how that goes. It's my favorite time, lunchtime. I know it doesn't look appetizing and you guys might think it looks gross, but ta-da, I made this yummy kale salad. I have this literally almost every day. It's like a copycat recipe from this Air One kale salad that I pretty sure I saw a TikTok video, but I make it and I think it's really good. You might not. It's, you know what? Honestly, it's probably not that good. I think I'm just obsessed with it currently. So lunchtime now, and then I will eat this. Then I need to change my outfit, do something with all this and go film a video for a company. So we're going to do that next. I fixed my hair, so I'm about to leave, but I can't believe I forgot to mention this all video. I got a puppy. <laughs> this is my little boy, Simba. I got him just over a week ago from a family in Houston. He's the sweetest. So I needed to cuddle with him for a little bit before I left. So that was the next thing that I did in my day. Look, <laughs> I'm obsessed. Okay, now I'm gonna leave and <laughs> go pick up some things I need for this video, film that um, before I have class, which is at four. Another update, I finished filming that video, just had to run and get something, then I came home to film it. And now I'm in class, it's four o'clock and it's my advertising class. We have a guest speaker today, so it's super interesting. So I'm back in my little Zoom area set up and you know I have the soft blanket and all. So on to class, and this one's a long one, it's three hours, so I'll see you guys in three hours. <laughs> update, it's now. 515 
and I wanted to do class outside. Like I was in the same spot for so long, I needed to mix up the scenery, but it's still the same class. It's my advertising class. We're just now doing it outside. Now it is time to take this little crazy man for a walk and we're gonna go walk to get Chipotle. Walk in the little boy. <laughs> we like to wait until it's pretty late so that his feet don't get super hot, but he's like really not good on the leash yet. But it's about eight o'clock. So we are gonna walk and grab my Chipotle. That's gonna be our walk of the night and then head home and eat dinner. So I guess we'll see you back at home. <laughs> Come on. He's so ridiculous. He got tired and we walked maybe a mile. Really? It's a workout for me. Home from my walk and I just ate my Chipotle for dinner and what are you doing, baby? Oh, he's playing with the chair. And I just opened some packages. Now I'm going to kind of show you guys what I do to wind down for bed, but it's a little different because we have a game tomorrow. And I've been trying to like incorporate different things to get my mind right for game day. So I'm gonna show you some of those things that I do. I'm just sitting comfortable in my bed now, but okay, that just scared me. This thing just, I don't know why that freaked me out. Okay, never mind. easily distracted. Speaking of easily distracted, okay. What I was about to say is I'm in my bed. Normally I try to avoid screen time before bed, especially if I have a game the next day. I get so distracted, I can be up for hours if I just am scrolling through social media or just videos or whatever it is. So try my best to keep all screens away, but obviously that's easier said than done. <laughs> I have been doing that's really been helpful for not only going into games, but going into practice is journaling. Not necessarily like my thoughts and stuff, but writing down the goals that I have for that practice or for that game and ways that I can, you know, make my teammates better or how I could be a better teammate that day and just whether it's before or after practice, if it's setting goals or if it's reflecting on how I thought practice was or if there's time for both, but it's been something that's been really helpful. So before games, I'm trying to incorporate that more this year and obviously our game tomorrow. So I need to write down a couple of things that I want to be thinking about going into the game and how I can try to make the team better tomorrow. My goal for the night was to be like ready for bed at 10 o'clock. Just missed. It's like 10, 10 and I need to go wash my face and then get in bed. But yeah, this was fun. I had a fun day showing you guys what I do. I always forget to film a bunch of it, but this was kind of the general gist of it. I think it'd be cool to show you guys a game day in the life though. So maybe I'll do that next. But anyway, thanks for hanging out. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you guys in the next Orange Bloods video.